Hi, I'm Julie McIntosh, Community Education Nurse with Compassion Care Hospice. Welcome to another episode of Friday FAQs. We know that if you're considering hospice, you may have many questions. So we put together this video series to address some of the most common questions we get when talking with people about hospice and palliative care. We hope that it's helpful to you. Today's question, who pays for hospice care? Oftentimes when I'm talking with a group of people and they learn about all of the benefits that hospice can provide, the very next question is, can I afford it? Will I be able to have this type of care in my home for myself or my loved one? And the answer is yes, you can. Hospice care is actually an entitlement under Medicare. It's covered under Medicare Part A, which is typically considered hospital insurance where if you go into the hospital, Medicare Part A pays 80% of your hospital stay. Well, when the time comes that someone's diagnosed with a terminal illness and is elected to do palliative or comfort care versus aggressive treatments, then that Medicare Part A switches over to providing hospice care. Um, and under Medicare A, it's covered at 100%, meaning that there are no out-of-pocket costs, no co-pays or deductibles under Medicare Part A. Now, if you're under Medicare age and you don't have Medicare, there are other payer sources for hospice as well. Um, it's covered under Medicaid, which is our state funded insurance for those that are of lower income and also covered at 100%. The Veterans Administration or VA covers hospice at 100% as well for service connected veterans. Now the VA doesn't provide hospice themselves, but they contract with community-based hospices like Compassion Care to provide the very best care to veterans at end of life. Um, besides Medicare A, Medicaid, and the VA, the final option is um, commercial insurance. Almost every commercial insurance plan does have a hospice care benefit. Now there's hundreds and hundreds of different types of plans. So when you're working with a hospice company, they should verify your benefits to find out what the hospice coverage is. And if there are any out-of-pocket costs such as co-pays or deductibles that you'll have to meet before hospice is covered at 100%. So what is included in this all being paid for 100%? It includes the entire team of healthcare professionals that you'll be seeing or your loved one. This includes the doctors, nurses, um, aides, CNAs, the social workers, the bereavement support specialists, the volunteers, et cetera. That whole team and all of their visits is provided free of charge. It also covers all uh, medical equipment that you or your loved one might need. This could be things like the hospital bed, um, oxygen, wheelchair, nebulizer machine, any of what we call durable medical equipment that is needed by the hospice patient is provided again free of charge. It also covers all medications that are related to the hospice diagnosis. So um, if somebody's on for congestive heart failure, all the medications related to that would be covered as well as all medications related to pain and comfort. They're all covered at 100% with no out-of-pocket costs again. We also cover any medical supplies that the patient might need. So this could be anything from wound care supplies. It can include things like incontinent care supplies as well. So as you can see, there's a lot of things that are covered under the hospice benefit, and it really is covered at 100%, and there are no out-of-pocket costs to you or your family. If you'd like more information on how hospice can help you or a loved one, please visit us at CompassionCareNevada.com or call us in our Las Vegas or Reno offices and we'd be happy to speak with you more about it. Remember, you don't have to do this alone. Hospice is here to help.